Hey, what's going on guys and welcome back to some more Minecraft Dragons today with me Tiny Turtle and Skiruba Steve. Skiruba Steve, you're making me dizzy. Yeah, yeah. I know. Come on. We, we, need, uh, we need to hurry up. Are you finished with the intro? We need to hurry up. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. No, no long intro today. Guys, we're going to no. get straight into it. We, no time to waste. We have received word that the Fire Nation does indeed intend to attack us from our scouts. And this is bad news because they obviously have the Robo Dragons. So yes. we need to get it, we need to get ready. Let's get our dragons in position. Let's fortify up some areas, set some traps maybe, Scuba Steve, if we can think of any. I mean, we probably don't have that long. No, we don't have too long. I think what we should do first is maybe get the dragons into a battle position. I think... If you look at the way the Fire Nation came the first time, they came by the sea. I reckon they're going to come that way again. They aren't very smart. Okay. The battle tactics are never really good. So I think they're going to come by the sea again. So I think if we set up our dragons in like, to the like, battle stations, maybe, facing towards where the Fire Nation boats were, that could be a good idea. Okay, I'm going to put the Alpha Night Stalker. Everybody's going to face the ocean, ready to go. And all the dragons yeah. know what's up. They can sense it. Yeah, let's put them... Maybe on the steps, so if Fire Nation soldiers try to come up the steps, they won't They're be dead. able to. They're the Night Stalkers dead. will completely defend the steps. I'm going to leave the two big Night Furies, Pyro and Spark, up here, as well as a couple of Mid Dragons and, of course, Rocky. And then, <clears throat> let's put you here. And then we can get the Monstrous Nightmares, maybe, out of their pen, because they Ooh, like yeah. some fires. Okay. I have a question. Yep. What is our position on the red death Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> do we let the red death out to oh. the nation or what I if mean, it goes wrong i have a, i think okay i got a great idea this could go this could go good or go not bad but you know it wouldn't be bad bad but okay <laughs> so we feed we feed the red death like loads like more than we've ever fed it Okay. 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 So then, when it comes out, it's not hungry, but it knows that it has to protect us. Now, usually after it, if I get fed loads of food, like a lot of junk food and stuff like that, you got to sleep. I pretty much I got to sleep. So that could happen. As well. <laughs> yeah. So we gotta be careful about that. But I think, I think maybe, I mean, we've been looking after the Red Death a lot. We have. We have. I mean, uh, I think maybe the Red Death, she might be like, uh, hey, these guys are kind of cool. And when she did break out, she only went for the Queen Death Gripper, who was a threat. I mean, she didn't threat, go yeah. for anything else, so... I mean, put it this way, none of our dragons, unless they all banded together, could take down the Red Death. So maybe she'd probably be like, uh, I'll help these guys fight their stupid little Fire Nation. Yeah, because these guys feed me lots of yes. yummy, yummy food. So... Okay. We need yummy, yummy food. Do you want to maybe get some I have yummy, yummy? I have yummy, yummy food. Do you? I'm, I'm on it, and I'm, I'm, I'm with the Red Death right wow. now. Now, I'm terrified of her. Well, I'm here. Okay, I'm getting the storm cutters all down and ready to go. Yeah, you keep you keep that. Okay, thing. obviously, the Myth Dragons are all on the, their battle stations. That's fine. Ooh. Let's get up here. Oh, she's mm. so big. Don't eat me. Okay, okay I really just need these guys to kind of face it. I don't want to eat the fish. Where did I put all these? They're just so big. Come on. Get over that. Oh, I'm walking on top of the mid dragon. No wonder. Okay, she's full. She is full. Okay, this is going to be pretty scary. Letting the red death dragon out. It's... Oh. Should I break some of the blocks? I mean, you can break some... Don't break them all yet. Let me get all these dragons in position first. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> this could be a really bad idea. It definitely could. But we have uh -oh. to be quick. Remember, we need to get to the yeah. dragon council. We said we check in with those guys. So let's kind of hurry this up, right? Yeah, nearly done. Okay, so I'm not going to bring Cloud out here because Cloud's still a bit young. Um, but you. I'll leave the Alpha and Wings and uh, Wings' girlfriend. There we go. Okay, that's pretty scary already. There's a lot of dragons waiting. You know, we got the Night Stalkers on the steps. We got some of the Night Furies up there. Of course, there's Night Furies still over in the Night Fury area. Oh, the Death Grippers? No, they'll work with the Fire Nation. We don't want to let them out. Yeah, we got to keep the Death Grippers oh, where the they drakes. are. The Drakes will definitely be good. And the, the Screaming drakes. Deaths. We got to yeah, let them out. you grab those. I'm going to keep 
Smashy, okay. smashy blocks here. All right, let's let them all out. And then we should be ready to go. We have no idea when this attack might take place, guys. But once we're prepared, then we should be okay. I mean, these are robot dragons. I don't know how strong they are. I don't know how many they are. But it's... I mean, uh, like, the fire of our dragons should probably melt them, maybe? It, it depends. I don't even know what they're made out of. That's the... The problem is we just don't know enough info on these, uh, Scuba Steve. Yeah, we do not know enough about them. That is true, but... Okay, this should be enough once more. Red Death is actually ready to go. Yeah, and uh, this should get the Screaming Deaths out. That's probably, yeah, that's a big enough gap. So let's get them. And yeah, Scuba Steve. Let's, you know what? Let's get them in place. Head over to the council really, really quick. And see if they can uh, spare any, like, Terex Warrior Dragons. Um, because obviously they've already been attacked and there's there is no council there So maybe the dragons are just sitting around we could use that to our advantage. Yeah, that is true Okay, let's get these bad boys in position All right, that ought to do it for now scuba Steve We can get the monstrous nightmares when we are back, but I'm pretty sure This is okay. this is very intimidating I mean if you pulled up to these shores and you saw all of this waiting you would turn and run. It is... <laughs> yeah. Just don't make any sudden movements, okay? Be nice. Ah! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Be careful. Well. Again, Skipper Steve. That's creepy. That red dead really doesn't like you. No, it doesn't like us. Uh, let's just get out of here. Um, Be All safe, right. guys. To the dragon council. Let's see if we can get some more dragons. All right, Skipper Steve. Keep your eyes peeled. Yes, I will. Oh. Okay. Ooh, they're, they're rebuilding the place. Yeah, and really quickly, you know, I actually felt wow. bad coming here and asking them for, like, you know, some some dragons as, as, and stuff like that. But they've put out all the fires. They've actually started to rebuild. Look at these guys. Whoa, yeah, quick. this is pretty awesome. I mean, that, that's pretty impressive to see that there's so many people here. They're already rebuilding. Everything is getting back up and running. And... Oh, look, okay, this is like a little medical area. Okay, they're getting better. They were covered in blood last time we saw them. Still treating um, some wounds. Um, okay. But, you know, maybe maybe we shouldn't ask for, you know, like, help straight away. Just ask how everything's, how they're doing. Just ask for an update. Okay, all right. Let's just see. Um, yeah. Play a kill. Uh, um, uh, excuse me. Ex oh, you must be, like, the general or something. But um, I'm just wondering how you guys are doing. Last time we were here, I mean... It was a mess. The Fire Nation had just attacked. And I want to know, is the council uh, okay? Ah, Tiny Turtle, Scuba Steve. It's good to see you two again. As you can see, the Dragon Council members are still missing. We tried a rescue mission, but it failed. On the bright side, we caught a Fire Nation soldier. You should go talk to him. Ooh, okay, amazing. Good job. Um, uh, that's good and bad news, I suppose. They tried a rescue mission already, but it failed. I mean, that is quick. Yeah, that is okay. really, really quick. I mean, they, like, I mean, look how quick they're rebuilding the place. Um, but the fact that they caught a Fire Nation soldier is pretty good. I reckon he's down where the Robo Dragons were. Yeah, it must be. Um, but I mean, if you look at this place, they clearly have some pretty brilliant builders i mean like some of the best yeah so and they've got a lot of money so they can pretty much be like yeah. hey somebody do this oh i forgot do i have my electric wings on <laughs> i just made sure i landed in the water no i, I don't have one okay well, i'm up oh why'd you danger. go down there <laughs> danger okay oh they're Ooh. rebuilding over here too oh nice okay see i told you these guys are quick these guys are insane i mean there's so many people in their nation as well it's there's so crazy. much money I mean, is it a nation or is it just like a council nation? I don't know. But this is pretty cool. Okay, yeah, good yeah, job, guys. Go. Keep up the good work. Ooh, <laughs> these guys have been interrogating this guy. Look, they got the gold swords out. Ooh, okay. Ooh, he looks like he's about to crack any minute. Tell him what he knows. Ask him. Ask him. Oh, oh dear. No, he's attacking me. Hey, stop it. You, back up. Soldiers. Soldiers, are you just going to let this happen? Now sit down and stay there or you'll get another whack of my shield. All right. Ooh, that's the last thing you want. Okay, are you ready to talk? Oh, fine, I'll talk. We have the Dragon Council members held hostage, but our main mission is to attack the Myth Nation. The attack is imminent. Uh oh, imminent okay, we means knew it was coming, but really soon. That means it's happening very, very soon. I think 
Oh, okay, we got to get out of here, Scuba Steve. This is not the right time for this. Okay, uh, imminent attack on the mid station. What can we do? I don't know if it's going to be good enough to stop them. I mean, these Robo Dragons are going to be really, really strong. Um, yeah, I was thinking, okay? Now, hear me out. I know he's crazy, and I know he's a crazy scientist, and he doesn't know really much about real dragons, but yeah. he did. the crazy scientist did create the dragons, the Robo Dragons. Yeah. So maybe if we go and talk to him he might be able to give us some information oh. you know to give us the upper hand on the on the fire nation because what about, those guys i don't know what, what are you thinking what about like what we were talking about some sort of jammer maybe yes he has exactly oh he might have something it'd probably be too big he might be able to build it at our nation oh that would be good okay okay yeah i think we need to go see him let's go there it's on the way back anyway so quick pit stop and then straight back to the mid nation and hopefully guys we can defend it well enough. Oh, I hope none of the dragons get hurt. I hate when it comes to some battles, but it has to happen to protect the strongest nation around. Oh no, Scuba Steve, there's Fire Nation here. Uh oh, that's not good. Oh, I hope they haven't gotten to him. Oh no, I don't have my sword. Okay. Oh, what? Here, I got a spare sword. It's okay, I got I got like a shovel. And yeah, okay. There's so weak. shield. <laughs> okay. They are pretty weak. This they are pretty weak. Okay. They're the worst trained soldiers ever, but they are still here, and there's a lot of them. What are they doing here? Okay, you go that way, I'll go this way. Kill them. They're everywhere. Maybe oh, they're oh, looking oh. for the scientists. Maybe they have the si Well, why would they still be here, though? Okay. Maybe they just launched the attack. We, we, could, be, we could be just in the nick of time. Oh, maybe this Let's is get... a stop on the way to Mid Nation. Maybe they sent yeah, a little party get to, over here. Get to, his, uh, get to his lab. Quick, quick, quick. We need to check it out. It's this way. Okay. There's more around here. Be careful. Oh, there's a few. Oh, there's loads around here. Okay, oh, they're there definitely oh, well. looking for the scientist. I'm oh, going to well. go in. I'm going to go in. Yeah, you go in. I got oh. this guy. They're inside. They're inside too. <laughs> what? You're beating them up with a shovel. Whoa. Hey, that guy took up, like, so many hits. He was way stronger. What? Oh, no. They've destroyed the place. Oh, they're looking no. for something. Where is he? Where is the scientist? Where is he? There's no sign of him. No, but these guys have been searching around. Maybe... Maybe he's not here. What if he's still up training dragons? Oh, what? He could be. Oh my goodness. He could be where we left him. That is where he is. I mean, it doesn't look that those guys found much and they just started destroying things. So, oh, well, we are so lucky. If he's up here, we are so lucky that they haven't caught him. Ooh, I think we got here just in time. Okay, the Drake is still up here. Ooh, um, please be up here. Please be up here. Grog, yes, yes, he's here. He's here? Scientist, yes. scientist, we just saved your lab. Well, the lab's kind of, it's, it's been tossed and turned. Um, it's gone. The Fire Nation were attacking the town. People have all fled. He, you must have been up here training them without even knowing, which is probably a good thing, but we need your help. We need something that will jam the robot dragons. The Fire Nation have your blueprints. They have the AI chip. They've made an army and it's on the way to attack our nation. So we need you to build something that will stop all robot dragons from functioning. Sure, no problem. Easy. I'll come with you and build it. I can fly my best friend, Chubby. Okay, that's... Hey, hold on a second. Wait, did you name this Chub guy Chubby? That's like Chub Chub. Don't be bringing up Chub Chub. <laughs> but it is a lot like Chub Chub. Wow, okay. Chubby. Perfect. You jump on. You guys have obviously been uh, bonding a lot more. We will follow, but make sure you get whatever materials you need to make this machine. Okay, I don't think she's eaten anybody yet, Scuba Steve. I mean, I haven't uh, checked. Yeah, uh, I you? Yeah. She really doesn't like when you get close at all. <laughs> just fish. I'm just trying to give you some fish. Let's see. Uh, yeah, everybody's still here. Everybody's still here. Uh, oh, Terex, you got a face. This way. This is where they're yeah, gonna come facing, from. Yeah, facing the wrong way now. Yeah, we can't have that. You're meant to be a warrior dragon. You're meant to protect us. Okay, let's see how. Ooh, it looks like, it looks like he's built it. <laughs> Whoa, oh, that is impressive. This is looking good. Okay, all right. How's it going, Mr. Scientist? This is looking pretty impressive. I mean, you've only been doing this for like ten minutes. It's insane. Well, you are good. Almost done. Should be ready in a minute or two. No robot dragon should be able to function within a hundred block radius. So stay close to this. Ah, Ooh. okay, a hundred blocks. You know what? We should we should walk that out and just figure out what we need to stay close to because, yeah, 
100 blocks isn't that far really when you no we need to see if we out. can actually make the radius a little bit um a little bit further out that'd be better if you could work on that that'd be awesome even if you got us like 200 blocks 200 it's better would than be nothing. much better i mean 100 probably only covers us back to behind here to about, yeah it's kind of like here. a small force field we need something big because we they can be, they can destroy a lot of our nation okay let's tell them let's tell them we need bigger we, we need, need bigger, bigger radius better but in the meantime we are gonna go and gather supplies because this could be like a siege war where we're under siege and we gotta just like you know what I Hold think? That ground here. I think yeah. they're gonna come at night, because Ooh, obviously they are gonna rain fire and it'll light the place up. So that is true. I think it's gonna be nighttime attack. So we have probably until the sun goes down, Scuba Steve, to get ready. Let's see if we can up the radius on this and get all of the rest of the dragons in place. And yeah, hopefully we can survive this, guys. But I hope you did enjoy today's episode. If you did, be sure to leave a big thumbs up on the video. Of course, subscribe if you are new. And we will see you soon for some more. Bye, guys. Bye.